Have you ever wondered how a hydrogen internal combustion engine works? Welcome to a journey into the heart of one of the most intriguing advancements in automotive technology. In the next 10 minutes, we'll be delving into the fascinating world of hydrogen internal combustion engines, often referred to as hydrogen IC engines for short. We'll explore the inner workings of these engines, dissecting the mechanics that make them tick. We'll discuss the benefits and drawbacks, highlighting what sets them apart from their petroleum counterparts. And if that's not enough, we'll also compare them to other types of engines, including hybrids, electrics, and even hydrogen fuel cells. This is a subject that's not just about understanding cars. It's about understanding the future, the potential shifts in energy consumption, and the race towards a more sustainable world. So, ready to dive into the world of hydrogen combustion? Buckle up, it's going to be an enlightening ride. First off, let's understand what a hydrogen IC engine really is. You might be familiar with the term IC, or internal combustion engine, which is what powers most vehicles on the road today. These engines typically run on gasoline or diesel fuel, but a hydrogen IC engine, as the name suggests, uses hydrogen gas instead. Now you might be wondering, why hydrogen? Well, hydrogen is the lightest and most abundant element in the universe, and it's also a clean source of energy. When hydrogen burns, the only byproduct is water vapor which makes it a fantastic alternative to the traditional fuels that release harmful pollutants into the atmosphere. So, how does a hydrogen IC engine work? Well, it's not too different from a regular IC engine. The basic concept is the same. Hydrogen gas is injected into the engine's cylinders, where it's compressed by the pistons. This compression raises the temperature of the hydrogen, causing it to ignite. The combustion of hydrogen generates a significant amount of energy, and this energy is what drives the pistons back down the cylinders. This downward motion is then converted into rotational motion, which ultimately powers the vehicle. Now you might have heard of hydrogen fuel cells, which also use hydrogen to power vehicles. But a hydrogen IC engine is different. While a fuel cell combines hydrogen with oxygen in a chemical reaction to produce electricity, a hydrogen IC engine uses the physical force of hydrogen's combustion to drive the vehicle. So, in a nutshell, a hydrogen IC engine is a type of internal combustion engine that uses hydrogen gas as its fuel source. It harnesses the power of hydrogen combustion to drive the vehicle, and the only byproduct of this process is water vapor, making it an environmentally friendly alternative to traditional gasoline or diesel engines. Now that we know what a hydrogen IC engine is, let's delve into how it works. The working of a hydrogen IC engine may seem complex, but we'll break it down for you. Let's start from the beginning, where our journey begins with a simple but crucial element, hydrogen. This abundant element is stored in a tank within the vehicle, waiting for its moment to shine. When the vehicle's ignition is turned on, hydrogen is released from the tank and directed towards the engine. This is where our second player enters the scene, the fuel injector. As the name suggests, the fuel injector's job is to inject the hydrogen into the engine's combustion chamber. This is done at a high pressure, ensuring the hydrogen is evenly distributed within the chamber. Now, if you're thinking there's a spark plug involved, you're absolutely right. Once the hydrogen is comfortably settled in the combustion chamber, the spark plug creates a spark to ignite the hydrogen. This is where things get exciting. When the hydrogen ignites, it creates a mini explosion. This explosion generates a significant amount of energy, pushing the piston down. The piston's downward movement turns the crankshaft, which is responsible for transferring this energy to the vehicle's wheels. The result? You're cruising down the highway, powered by the most abundant element in the universe. But what happens to the byproducts of this process? Well, that's the beauty of a hydrogen IC engine. The only byproduct of hydrogen combustion is water vapor, which is expelled from the vehicle's exhaust. So not only are you driving with zero emissions, you're also contributing to a cleaner and greener environment. And that, folks, is how a hydrogen IC engine works. But what about its benefits and drawbacks? Like all things, hydrogen IC engines have their fair share of pros and cons. Let's start with the upsides. First up, we have the environmental benefits. Hydrogen IC engines emit only water vapor as a byproduct, making them a clean alternative to traditional engines that emit carbon dioxide. This positions the hydrogen IC engine as a potential game changer in the fight against climate change. Next, we have the promise of high efficiency. Hydrogen has a higher energy content per unit of weight than any other fuel. This means that in theory, a hydrogen engine could be far more efficient than its gasoline or diesel counterparts. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. While these advantages are promising, hydrogen IC engines also face significant hurdles. The first is hydrogen storage. Storing hydrogen safely and compactly is a tough nut to crack. 
Hydrogen has a low density, which means it requires a lot of space. It also has a tendency to leak from containers and can cause explosions if not handled properly. The second challenge is hydrogen production. Today, most hydrogen is produced from natural gas in a process that emits carbon dioxide. So, while the engine itself may not emit CO2, the production of its fuel might, which somewhat tarnishes its green credentials. And then, there's the issue of infrastructure. We simply don't have a widespread network of hydrogen refueling stations. Building one would require a substantial investment and a lot of time. Lastly, there are the costs. Hydrogen IC engines are currently more expensive to produce than traditional engines, which could make them less appealing to consumers. While the pros and cons are substantial, how does the hydrogen IC engine stack up against other types of engines? Now let's see how hydrogen IC engines compare to regular IC engines, hybrid engines, and electric and hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. First, let's compare it with the regular internal combustion engines. While both types use combustion, the hydrogen IC engine has the edge when it comes to environmental impact. It emits water, not carbon dioxide, making it a cleaner alternative. However, a downside is that currently, hydrogen IC engines are more costly due to the high price of hydrogen and the need for specialized storage and fuel systems. Next up are hybrid engines. These engines use both gasoline and electricity, providing a balance between environmental friendliness and power. Hydrogen IC engines, on the other hand, rely solely on hydrogen, making them even cleaner. But again, the cost factor and the lack of hydrogen infrastructure can be stumbling blocks. Then we have electric vehicles. They are the epitome of clean and quiet transport with zero tailpipe emissions. Compared to them, hydrogen IC engines do have emissions, albeit just water. However, hydrogen engines can refuel faster than electric vehicles can recharge, which could be a significant advantage in some situations. Finally, let's compare hydrogen IC engines with hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. Both use hydrogen as fuel, but the way they use it is different. Fuel cell vehicles convert hydrogen into electricity, which powers an electric motor, while hydrogen IC engines combust the hydrogen directly. This makes hydrogen IC engines less efficient, but potentially more powerful. Plus, they don't require expensive fuel cells, which can be a big plus. In terms of practicality, hydrogen IC engines face challenges, like the need for a comprehensive hydrogen fueling infrastructure. But they also offer unique benefits, such as rapid refueling and high power output. So where does all this leave us? Let's wrap up. We've covered a lot of ground today from understanding hydrogen IC engines to comparing them with other engines. We've learned how these marvels of engineering work, unraveled their advantages and drawbacks, and even put them head to head with other engine types. Let's not forget, the future of hydrogen IC engines is bright and brimming with potential. With their ability to reduce carbon emissions and their high efficiency, they could revolutionize the automotive industry. Imagine a world where your car runs on the most abundant element in the universe, hydrogen. Sounds like science fiction, doesn't it? But it's not, it's science fact and it could be closer than you think. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the intricacies of engines. If you enjoyed this content and are as excited about the future of engines as we are, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating content. Until next time, keep exploring the world of engines.